Here is my tip for new traders. If you are new and you are going to trade a particular setup, create a setup pattern book for yourself. You should have as many examples as possible of good setups. That becomes your template for finding good setups. So if you are going to be trading say a breakout setup, you should have at least 20-25 examples of good breakout setups. That means you know what to look for in a good breakout setup and then refer to your book and continuously add to that book. So if last week there was some good breakout, whether you missed it or you didn't take it, but like you should put it in your book. Your book should be a continuously developing document in which you document good patterns because then your memory will be built off focusing on good patterns. If you are going to be looking for bull flags, that is what your setup is, then you should create examples of bull flag and make a booklet full of setup ideas. This is very important because when you are in the heat of the move, you may not be using the right kind of a setup to enter uh, uh, the right kind of a setup. So create your own setup book first thing. That should be your first task. If you are not making money, it's even more critical because then you don't have a setup then it's very difficult. So create a setup book. So I'll show you an example, two examples of setups, which I look for basically. And those are the kind of setups which I look for. So I look for a breakout setup. So in a breakout setup, this is an example of a good breakout setup. Uh, or this is an example of a good breakout setup. So there's a first leg, sideways move, and then the stock breaks out, right? So that is this kind of a pattern book is what I built in the beginning years and I had pattern books and I used to go through them every time at like five, six, seven, eight times. And as a result, if I see a pattern, which is what fits my setup idea, I can find it instantly. And that is your task as a beginner trader. Whatever you're going to be trading, two or three setups, whatever it might be, it might be support and resist, find 20 or 25 good examples and not only something which has happened in 1987 or 1988 or 1990, but in the current market. And continuously add to that setup book. So every week, go back, look into the market, the setups which were the perfect setups which you would like to trade all day are the setups which you put it into your setup book. If you are a day trader, same thing applies. Every day, at the end of the day, you should go through stocks which have made big moves, find setup ideas, which you should have taken, put them into a book and make that book as your reference book. You have to write your own book if you want to be successful in this business. And that is the first task 